hi guys welcome back to my channel today's video is gonna be really quick I'll show you how I achieve these curls that I'm working right now using the African thread method and um, just start with your hair brushed out detangled however you want it and just section the hair you're gonna need a brush I'm using my Den Denman brush that I always use and some old Mali hair and if you know me, I don't like really, really um, small curls. So I take a big section of hair, brush it out, make sure it's really well detangled. And then hold the thread at the base and just twist it around the hair twice, very tightly. And then very loosely twist all the way down. So just try to be consistent with the space in between um, each twist. Because that will give it a nice perfect curl. I was not really perfect with it but I'm not worried about that once you get to the tip just hold on to the Mali hair itself and scrunch your crochet braids up so just push it all the way up make sure it's nice and tight and then um, tie up the tip of the hair to make sure it's nice and secure And once you're sure it's nice and secure, take a pair of scissors and cut the excess Mali hair off. Again, I'll show you how I did that. Brush the hair, hold on to the Mali hair, twist very tight, maybe twice or three times at the base and then loosely twist all the way down. And then once, it's, once you get to the tip, just scrunch it up and tie the excess Mali hair. Make sure it's nice and secure and cut the excess off. This style is really quick and very easy. Um, if you're watching my video for the first time, I have absolutely no idea what I'm talking about. I'm going to put links in the description below to all my previous videos and information about the hair as well. Um, I did say I was going to do two more. I believe curl set for this hair before I take it out because the hair is getting really old and I need to take it out of my hair I'm going to do one more next week I believe and then I'll be done with this hair um, so just go through the hair do the same process make it as big or as small as you want and then once you're done with everything and you're sure it's all nice and secure next thing to do is to dip this hair in very hot water so make sure you're careful with this um, make sure to use a small cup and take your time deep in the hair if you have someone else that can help you that would be perfect um, just make sure to have the hair in for about maybe 15 seconds and just hold it there make sure you have a towel to um, pick up the excess water once you take it out and please be very very careful with this so now I'm done dipping the hair and I'm just um, taking out all the excess water and then I sat under the dryer for about 20 minutes <laughs> eating some popcorn and talking to my friend. Um, once that's nice and dry, all you need to do now is just take out the molly hair that you used to wrap the hair and just cut from the tip or from the base whatever way you want to do it and voila you have some nice curls so just go throughout the hair and take out all the thread or the Mali hair that used to thread the hair and then all you, you need to do now is just separate the hair you don't have to do it um, I just like it more separated I don't really like the really really tight looking curls so I just went through the whole hair and separated the curls and that's pretty much everything about this hair I really like the way the hair turned out if you have any questions just ask down below and I'll be happy to answer thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video bye hello guys welcome back to my channel um, today I wanted to do some makeup. I've not done 